Like a classic rock song, the challenger quickens the heart rate and stirs up nostalgia. Its old school roots are obvious, witness the retro design and simplistic interior. Available with a class exclusive, all wheel drive powered rain for the base V6 engine, Dodge's Pony car also can be fitted, in rear wheel drive form, with a 375 horsepower or mighty 485 horsepower Hemi V8. Both engines have a standard 6-speed manual transmission, a proficient 8-speed automatic is optional. The Challenger's cushy ride and comfy cabin make it a compelling cruiser, but the Chevrolet Camaro and the Ford Mustang have elevated performance expectations. What's new for 2018? The 2018 Challenger has minor updates that include new standard equipment, performance upgrades, and exterior colors. Red Brembo brake calipers are now an option on several V8 trims. An all-new performance handling package is available on models with the 5.7-liter V8. It includes four piston Brembo brakes and a tuned suspension. The all-wheel drive Challenger GT adds optional 19-inch wheels with painted pockets. The Super Track Pack on the SXT Plus and RT Plus trims now features Napa leather and Micro Suede sport seats. The SXT, RT, RT Shaker, and TA models receive a standard 7.0-inch Uconnect touchscreen. A backup camera is now standard, too. The 2018 Challenger lineup adds F8 green and Indigo blue exterior colors, which have late availability. B5 blue and Plum Crazy also return later in the year. What was new for 2017? Apart from a light exterior refresh and a significant interior redesign for 2015, the Challenger hasn't been completely new since it returned from the dead in 2008. For 2017, the lineup adds the heritage-inspired TA and TA392 models. Along with unique exterior and interior elements, they have wider wheels and stickier tires. The 392 version has more powerful Brembo brakes. The TA twins also share a cold air induction system similar to that used in the Challenger SRT Hellcat. Every Challenger has an updated Uconnect infotainment system, the optional 8.4-inch touchscreen with navigation adds multi-touch gestures. Models equipped with the 5.7-liter V8 now have an active exhaust system. Among the other additions are standard houndstooth cloth seats on some models and revised paint choices. Green Go. Yellow Jacket, Destroyer Grey, and Octane Red are new colors, while White Knuckle and Contusion Blue are renamed carryovers. Trims and Options We Choose The Challenger's optional 485 horsepower 6.4-liter V8 is the most powerful engine in its class, the 707 horsepower Challenger SRT Hellcat and 840 horsepower Demon are in another league altogether. We prefer the regular Challenger paired with the RT Scat Pack, starting at $40,090 which includes the 6.4-liter V8, for the best balance of appearance and performance. The 8-speed automatic transmission costs $1,500 for this trim, but it avoids the 6-speed manual's $1,000 gas guzzler tax so it's effectively a $500 option. Its standout standard features are 20-inch wheels a high-performance Brembo brake package, rear parking sensors, and an 8.4-inch Uconnect touchscreen with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. The only options we dad are Driver Convenience Group Package, Blind Spot Monitor, Rear Cross Traffic Alert, High Intensity Discharge Headlights, and more, for $1,095. Dynamics Package, Wider 20-inch Black Wheels, 6-piston Brembo front brake calipers, for $2,200. Pirelli P0 summer tires for $695. Our Challenger RT Scat Pack with the standard 6-speed manual rang up at $44,880. The Dodge doesn't dominate the V8-powered Ford Mustang GT or Chevy Camaro SS at the track but its hefty horsepower rating and retro roots recreate the good old days better than both.
two damn phones, Babylon's came.